Hey everybody, T1 Glisten Ralph here. Back to play some more games with one of my patrons. Uh, this is Rukulin, and she's a big EDH fan. Well, EDH on Arena is Brawl, so uh, she and I are just going to be jamming some some games against one another. Uh, let's see. I now we actually played already. We played yesterday, but my computer decided to crash when I was recording, so we're gonna we're gonna take two. Uh, this is one that she didn't say last time, and if you would like to challenge me and get on, on YouTube, <laughs> then be a patron on Patreon. Link it down in the doobly-doo. But now we have a Layla Artful Provocateur. So, Flying Death Touch Lifelink, other creatures you control with flying get plus one plus zero. When you cast an artifact or enchantment, geez, all for four mana. Uh, this is okay. Yep, yeah, we'll keep. That's all right. This isn't one that she ended up seeing last time, so... Uh, but it's Thalia. I imagine you probably can figure out how this is supposed to work. Artifact and enchantment creatures uh, will pose a bit of a problem, but the artifacts and enchantments themselves, if they aren't creatures, should be fine. So Thalia first. All right. <laughs> Protection for multicolored, but no reach. Rip. Rip and pepperoni. Okay, we don't want to use that yet. I think I would like to do Kinjali Sunwing first. No, maybe I'm supposed to hold up the Mind Sensor. Yeah, we'll hold up the Mind Sensor, actually. Boom. Alright, yep. Ta-da! Okay. Ooh, yeah, that's this again. Yeah, it's three mana. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, we'll just do this now. And this, uh, creatures, only creatures. Well, fair enough, I suppose. Um, hmm. Lieutenant would put a counter on Thalia, or Aven Mind Sensor, but I think we want Thalia for this. Hmm. Get, dude, dude, chill, chillax. Yeah, next turn, though, she's about to get out her commander, so we'll play the Sunwing instead. So now her commander won't be able to block. At least for a little bit. Which matters because her commander has death touch and three toughness. Which is a pretty strong combination against me. Alright. Or it would be, except... ha 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 Counter on you. There we go. So first strike, three power. We'll take that. We will take that. All right, top four cards. Mind sensor got there. Rip. Oh dear. Yeah, hate bears the deck. Hate bears the deck. Yep. Okay. Um, still didn't get another land. So we can use Loxodon just to build a big board? Hmm, okay. Creature without flying. So that's not terribly useful at all. <laughs> not in the least. Okay, so I could go for Charming Prince, Scry 2. Yeah, that's all we do. So Charming Prince first. Let's see. Try to set up our draws a little bit. Hello. Um. I don't know that there are going to be that many. Hmm. That many creature artifacts or enchantments. If I can find another land, Cavalier would be nice. Yeah, let's put those both down. I'm going to give up a turn of attacking. Alright. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Hey. Alright, find a land, please. Mm. 
I'm actually not completely sure why I still have Trapped in the Tower in here. Ooh. Sorry, what does this do again? Ooh, okay. Yay, my devotion to white is a lot. I could have waited a little bit longer, though, to be honest. Uh, I would lose the Mind Sensor, wouldn't I? Double block to get rid of Sunwing. That is Vigilance. I'm a little paranoid about... Um, about first strike, but yeah, there's no mana open. I've seen that before, and it's scary. Yeah, let's swing with the team. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, wait, wait, is that game? We're not even... Oh, okay. Okay. I think that that might have been a little bit premature, but I, I can understand. Hmm. Okay. I don't know what all was in her hand, though, so maybe she, maybe she could uh, see the writing on the wall. Sorry. Thalia is silly. Oh, uh, actually, first, let's make sure. Um, another historic uh, brawl? Or standard. Just making sure. Oh, we sh hmm. After the game, do you oh, you, you just don't get to see. Let me make sure my messages are going through. Because I don't remember them going away like that. Are my messages coming through? Hello, I can spell. To you. I, I don't remember them disappearing like that after typing them. Huh. Can't see them, no. Uh, same. Well, Arena. Is there a setting maybe I'm... Hmm. Give me just a moment. Beep. All right. And one, two, three. Yeah, I love Rukulin's comment. Arena's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we had issues yesterday. We have. We're having issues today. Day before yesterday, Arena had issues where uh, the Momir event had to go down. So that was fun. <laughs> uh, apparently, there's some bug where it would. Uh, force a draw for whatever reason. And there may have been some other stuff going on too. Good times. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Uh, let me type, how about now? Alright, then go out, and then go back in, see if it's still there. It's still there! Yay! <laughs> Alright. Nice. Alright. Historic or standard brawl? <laughs> Pally is not very nice here. I know. At least it's the beautiful Joe art. <laughs> she has the, the pink K. Yeah. The pink cape. <laughs> the long flowing pink cape. Alela was probably the worst tank to play against that. <laughs> oops. Oh wait, wait, wait. Crap, crap, crap. I, I did the, uh, I made a, I made an oopsie. I have to actually hit brawl. There we go. Yeah. You're not wrong. I, I didn't make a change to Vivian that I, I should have made, so I'll do that after this game. Um, hmm. So what I did yesterday is I played Rats Davriel first, 
And then I play Davriel again so that she might think I'm doing the same thing. No, it's, uh, it's Rack this time. We're playing Rack. Okay. I, I'm almost positive she had a winning... I'm positive, actually, she had a winning record on me yesterday. But so far, so good. Uh, you know what? Sure, we're on the draw. That's, that's ideal, actually. Since we're playing Rack, we kind of want to be on the draw. Gives one fewer card. Reese. Hi, Reese. Alright, um... This is awkward. Uh, yeah, let's do... There's no reason not to do Tiny Bones first here. Discard gets better the more you light it, the longer you wait on it generally, if it's not targeted discard, like Burglar Rat is. Kinda would like to kill this race soon, though. If I do, she'll just cast it right back. Um... I still probably should, right? Alright, so we make ourselves an elf. Uh, it's not much of a point in attacking here. Oh wait, I have tiny bones, and tiny bones cost me life, so I, I do want to be a little bit careful. No, you stop that. Your spirit cards love you. Oop, hello? Hello, there we go. Let's see. Well, let's just get it started. Alright, I will get to drawing a bunch of cards. Okay. Oh man. Oh man, yeah, Obliterator needs to be the next one. Definitely Obliterator, just to try to hold back a little bit. Alright, make her discard something. Yeah, I don't think I have too much of a choice here. Yeah, this was a weird line. I could have played Davriel sooner, but I didn't. Alright, so now we get to draw a card. Now that I don't get to play the land. Alas. Hmm. I could really use a waste knot right about now. We are well behind at this point. Alright, so I can go Burglar Rat. Oh, should have done Agonizing Remorse first. No, no, that's fine. I can play Murderous Rider here. Or I could play Davriel. Uh, Murderous Rider doesn't actually save me, though. Alright. I'm gonna try to leave you running on empty. Alright, so draw another card. And then deals two. Yeah, I think she kind of just got <laughs> that, uh... <laughs> and the other one. <laughs> and the other one. So she was telling me yesterday that Arcane Signet and Felidar Retreat are uh, the cards that seem to keep showing up for her every time, which is true. They totally are. Where could, where's my lifelink? That would be nice. Deals combat damage to a player. That player discards a card at random. If that player can't, you draw a card. Hmm. So... Hmm. Murderous Rider Finlurker? Oh, wait a minute. We're getting pretty close to this point, aren't we? Not yet, though. Let's just play defense for a little bit. Let Davriel uh, put Rooklin into, uh, into threat range. Pass turn. Okay, so 
if we can get to the point where Rukulin passes to us, not this time, but one more time, then we'll be okay. Oh, this is a sorcery. If that had been an instant, I could have used it just then. Okay. Uh, make her discard it, and then fire it off in response. There it goes. Uh, sure. Alright, that does make this a little trickier, though. See, the reason is, if Rukulin doesn't play the card that she gets here, if I use Tiny Bones during my turn, she'll attack, because she doesn't want to die. If she doesn't play it, Tiny Bones has a bit of an issue. I'm thinking. There's no sorcery speed restriction. Um, let's see, and you're a 4-3. You're a 4-5. No, I'm just going to hope that Rukulin doesn't see it and plays the card out. Also, this is a sorcery. Uh... That makes another one. That's all right. It's not great, but I can live with that. Oh yeah, she wouldn't have played it anyway. Yeah, let's just do it now. All right. All right, you have to play that. Well, you can't play that card. You just have to, oh, there's Reese. So I don't have quite enough... There we go. That's game. Alright, going for the attack. No, we're not. Tiny Bones. Oh dear. Tiny Bones is being a jerk. That almost should have been the, the commander there. Almost. Reese is fun. Um, and to be fair, I think Reese is one of the commanders that can better play against the discard side of the deck. Because other than land drops, you don't like, once you get enough mana, Reese can just take over the game on its own. Um, but there you go. You had me worried for a moment. Ooh, yeah, had it come back around to my turn, I actually did have a way to make her discard. It was Davriel. I could have used Davriel to discard. Uh, because it doesn't have any uh, qualifications on it. Davriel's silly. I did? I saw no way of winning there. Oh. Um. I mean. <laughs> I was worried about. Uh. Letting Reese. Uh. Letting you untap with... There we go. Untap with Reese again. The kill spell... The kill spiel was nice to have. One of the joys of Reese is that you may not have to play your cards after all once you get six lands, six mana sources, once to you, to you. <laughs> Channeling my inner Celtic. All right. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, Irish? Yeah, not, no, why, why am I? Turn two tiny bones around <laughs> everything. Yeah, it did, even though the, the next discard didn't happen for a while. Uh, yeah, my, my family on my mom's side comes from Ireland. So, I'm... I, I don't have a strong, like, uh, salience for it, I guess. I'm not, like, Irish Catholic or... Let's, let's make a quick change to Vivian, actually. Uh, what else? There's a, something I was going to get rid of way down here, I remember. 
Hmm, or maybe not. Let's see. Maybe... Hmm. What was it? What was I going to get rid of? Oh, no, dude. It doesn't let me scroll that way. Actually, I'm going to be a little strange, I suppose, and take this out. No, that's just too good. It's way too good. Alright. There's not enough trample in my deck, so we'll take that out and put in Guardian Project. There we go. Got the... Hello? Oh, because I just made it not standard. That's why it was that way. That's what... Okay, you know what? Never mind. This is, uh... <laughs> this is Brawl Vivian. One card different. But this is, uh, Historic Brawl, I should say. One card different. I'll just remember to change that back. Alright. Let's do this. Instead of playing the Flax... I probably should have played the Flax and Intruder, right? No, it's okay. Uh, let's make sure we hit our land drops. Spectral Sailor. I already don't feel great about this one. Hmm. Alright, Cobra. <laughs> Purple Cobras. Hmm. Okay. Nice. All right, let's see what I can do. Not enough yet. We'll just, uh... Hmm. We'll just draw a card. I could get the ramp with Humble Naturalist. All right, that can deal with Acuity, potentially. Why is she a 1-2 one, for 1 that also has an extra little bit? I remember the good old days of 1-1s one, for 1 mana that had abilities. Maybe 1-2s that didn't. Oh well. Oh well. Ooh. Oh dear. Alright, so let's make some mana. I'd like to do Feasting Troll King. But I'd also like to put out Vivian, because she can make 3 threes to block. But Vivian will die after that, is the issue. Um... Thinking. I have 1, 2, 3... Uh, 1, 2, 6. There you go. 6 mana. Hmm. This may be wrong. Let's see, if I play the Vivian out, she'll go to 4 with a 3-3 three, three with reach. Yeah, we can still lose her next turn. Feasting Troll King first. I actually could attack with the Lotus Cobra, but I don't know. I think it's okay. We'll wait. Aha! Okay. Now what's your shtick? Three or more creatures you control with flying attack. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. They get- she gets my Troll King. Hmm. I think that's game. How did I not see that? And to be fair, it's non land permanent. She would have had my Vivian afterwards. Yeah, I think we're just done here then. Alright, reach. <laughs> I 
I have to have one. <laughs> yeah, let's see if it'll let me do... There we go. <laughs> Alright, yeah, this deck is great. This deck is cool looking. That is... Oh wow. Hello. Uh, you know what? I think that we're... I think we're done. Uh, especially since I can't block anything, can I? Just you. Yeah, that's... That would do it. Unfortunately, that would do it. Alright. Probably not a good idea to bring... <laughs> to bring standard to historic. Alright, uh, I, will f I will fix that really quickly. Alright, what was the, uh, what was the card that just was? Now I've forgotten. Of course I have. Of course I have. It was, uh, oh, uh, lead the stampede. Nope, not lead. Lead is right here. It was... Oh. Hey, enchantment. It was an enchantment. There we go. Let's just really quickly get this sorted out. Really quickly. Grief, what was it? Uh, zip. Colossal Magic. Zip. No, that's already in. Zip, 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 zip. Hydra's Growth, that's right. All right, cool, we're back. And we're back. Okay, so let's fix Chu Lane really quickly by doing the same thing, by adding uh, Guardian Project. It turns out it's a good card. Although, wait a minute, it would be another... It'd be two... I would have two non-flash spells in the deck. Just two. I think that one's worth it, though. Need to figure out what to take out, though. Hmm. How many lands am I rocking? 24? Nah. Who needs that many? Who needs that many? Yeah, seriously, let, let's drop it down one. Boop. There we go. Alright. See if you've sent me a request. Yep. Okay. Alright. Sorry, Rukulin. That, that took a little longer than I thought. And you. Conveniently, right there at the front. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. We played this matchup yesterday. Didn't we play this one yesterday? Alright, here we go. Uh, we're missing white mana. I'll take the free mulligan. Oh, god. That went even worse. Um... Okay, there's an omen of the hunt. If we can last just a little while, then we can make it work. I don't know why I'm doing this. Alright. And if not, we have Nimble Obstructionist if we can find blue mana, but by that point, the omen won't be. It's, it's fine. Alright, let's see if we can get there. Nope, not so far. Alright. I have made my bed, now I must lie in it. Uh oh. Okay. Kind of got there. Hey, we'll take it. At least we didn't miss any land drops. Not as quickly as we would have liked, but we didn't miss them. Alright, what's next? And... I can actually take out both of those. She would get to draw a card. 
Um, I don't have a way to. Yeah. Pay for EDH online, after all. <laughs> Alright. There we go. Cast your commander. Nope, that's okay. Sure. Uh, we're getting... we're getting on up there. The Supreme Will won't have too many more chances to get used. I need to be careful. Very careful. Okay. We'll let it go. My turn. Go for Omen and Spectral Sailor. There we are. Nothing has reach on her side. Let's see. I have a sneaking suspicion we're not going to be doing a lot of blocking with this 1-1 anyway. Uh, if I crack this for green, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, we have two lane, but we don't have anything else with which to use it. Why am I doing this now? Why did I just do that then? Oh well. What's done is done. Yeah, she's actually going to be able to get Emil through. Uh, through the Supreme Will. Well through. Jeez. Nope, we're doing this instead, aren't we? Search your library for two basic lanes, put them on the back, and tap, and shove the library. This spell is kicked. Um, yeah, the Supreme Will is just going to be a bad anticipate. An expensive anticipate at this point. I say we let it go. Alright. Ow, ow. There you are. Beep. We did it! Yay! We got there. Alright, let's draw a card. Put that in tapped. See if we play. And we get our we get our Zambonis. It's Zamboni time. Um, let's go. Just you. Do. Alright. And then in the turn. I, I imagine I'm going to see everyone's favorite horsey friend. Nope, not yet. Alright, that's cool. Helio's intervention will will appreciate the offering. Uh, it's not my preference, but we're actually going to do this now. I believe. I could actually play the Ambusher instead. Or I could use the Heliod's Intervention but not kill the Simulacrum. Yeah, that, that's probably what I'll end up doing. So, Night... yeah, here we go. Night Pack Ambusher. Block here. Yes, it resolves. Um, let's scry two, since we, we lack a little bit of mana. Ooh, Blast Zone. That's actually kind of nice. Sensor, though, is probably right out at this point. Alright, make another Zamboni. Zamboni. 
uh, just you, for now. We'll do more in just a, just a second. Beep. Alright. And then we'll do this. Destroying one, two. The only two. Ta-da! That way there's not some silly mana doubling going on. Alright. There we go. I'm trying to play a little less awfully. Oh my goodness. Uh, you know what? Let's draw a card first. Well, okay. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hmm. Which one's more important? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, we have enough for both. So let's do this. Get a Zamboni. I will never not call it that, I believe. Settle's probably okay. It's a little awkward against Emil, though, because Emil can make it where the creature's no longer attacking. I'm going to risk it. Um, yes, let's pass. There it goes. Can't stop it. Sadly, no. All right. Resolve that one, and then cycle to counter the triggered ability. Ta-da! Frilled Mystic, right on time. Oh! Now that, though, that's a problem. Alright, and I take three, as you do. Ooh, let's let's hang on to that one. Okay, okay, master. Let's hang on to that. Huh. Okay. This first. Yeah, no extra cards in hand. Right. And then we pay three. Yes. One, two, three. Beep. Yes, yes, we will counter that. Ah, uh, now... Uh, no, you stop that. You stop that. Right now, oh no! Yeah, Mirai's wake. What can you do? Alright, that's a, uh, unfortunately, Voracious Gear Shark, or what is it, Gear Shark, Gear Hulk, Voracious Great Shark. It's, it's, a uh, Gear Hulk for sharks, instead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We are busted. Alright. What's this? Five? Actually, at this point, it doesn't matter, does it? Oh, boy. It feels as if there's not a right answer. Let's see, two, three, four, five, seven. Okay. Um, and it's destroy target permanent, non land permanent. Whee! Uh, that's game. That's game. I guess we'll do it now, and then we'll try to counter her. 
counter her on the way back down. Alright, blow up the last two. Uh, nope, nope, we're doing this instead. I guess when you have all the mana and you can just do all the things, <laughs> there's no reason not to. Here, let's hit resolve all. And then after this, she's just going to cast her right back. Whee! I'm trying, folks. I'm doing what I can. Oh boy. Well, please cast pre combat. Yep. Alright. Not that it matters, I'm still not going to be able to do it, but <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying, folks. Yep, there we are. If I had a way to give Chulane haste, can you imagine? Alright. Oh, uh, I should have paid the two. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> It's almost like you're trying to win or something. Who try who does that? <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. You know what? Just because. Just because we can. Get the zombie gets gored by a unicorn. Yeah, that, that went pretty much the same way last time. Pretty much. As much as I like my commander, that happens. <laughs> that happens sometimes. Alright. Let's see. I think we have a few more in us. Or I certainly do. Beep. There we go. I remembered this time. Meter Gum's a pretty good substitute for Cavalier, as it turns out. You're not wrong. <laughs> uh, let's see. Ooh, let's do this again. Uh, I have a sneaking suspicion that Jode is not going to work as well as last time, because last time was in sa Same matchup! Wait. I'm pretty sure this is the same matchup. Hmm, okay. Well, this is awkward. We can make it work, though. Alright, since I do still have the Incubation Druid turn 2 into Beanstalk Giant turn 3. <laughs> oh, and I have a turn timber symbiosis anyway. It's back! <laughs> Alright, let's see. I can do up to four mana here. Put it into your hand, though. I don't have any planes in my deck. That's that's not good. That's not good. It's no bueno. It's no bueno. Alright. So we're going to have this come in tapped, and then use Beanstalk Giant to get a planes. And that covers all my colors. Let's see. White, green, red, blue, black. There we go. Oh, you know what? I probably should have put Joda out, right? That would have made sense. Hmm. Alright, now... Now he's dead. He's gonna die. Oh. Mm. Mm. There we go. Uh. Oh, there we go.
here we are. Hello. Oh crap. Deals combat damage to a player. Reveal that many. Oof. Oof. Wait a minute. White, green, blue, red, black. Okay, so even if I give up the druid, I'll still be able to cast something. And the thing I'll be able to cast is... Meteor Golem. Alright, so we'll try to give fewer dinosaurs if possible. We'll try. Alright, so five cards. Hello. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright. Well, that actually changes things a little bit. We still have to blow up Gal we have to blow up Galta now, I believe. Since uh, Zatalpa won't actually protect me from Galta. Alright. Um please don't do that again. That's pretty good. Ooh, okay. Uh that's not something you want them to get counters on though. Uh oh. And this is all before attacks, mind you. Oh my goodness. And they're all bigger. Uh. Yeah. Alright. I'm trying. I'm trying, folks. Alright, so that's three. Or that's five. Sorry, not three. Three damage, five that went through. Ooh, but none. Okay, okay, okay. We have a chance. Not really, but I'm, I'm going to pretend we have a chance. Zatolpa Primal Dawn. Okay. No, thankfully... No, no, we're still in trouble. Okay. Well, if she attacks with Gashoth, it'll still die, but one point will be able to make it through. Actually, I'm dead. I'm just dead. Look at this damage. I'm dead. And trigger. Trigger the Ceratops. Yay. Ah. Ah. That's the sound that makes. I mean, no. I, I can't give up my own Zatalpa. Can I? Boom. Boom. Okay. I guess I could use this just to get another blocker, but that does not a win make. Especially with this. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah, about that. Um, I don't think we can win from here. No, we can't. <sighs> That's a shame. We just got to a bit too slow of a start. I might actually try this again. Try this deck one more time. You can see what it's trying to do, for sure. I mean, I didn't quite get enough for Emergent Ultimatum to do its thing. Not yet. Ooh. Oh, God. Stop. Alright. One d damage to any target. Yep, that makes sense. Five damage to target creature opponent. <laughs> it's Chain Lightning where you hit your own stuff. You know what? Just for shiggles. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. But I got the satisfaction of killing your commander too. <sighs> that uh, could have gone a little better. I think. 
I would say. Maybe. Alright. I'll give that one another go. Dino Smash still a valid tactic. <laughs> I thought that was nerfed 65 million years ago. I can't help myself. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Shout outs to Tirzu for that one. Yeah, let's go to select deck. Okay, there we go. One B. I'm gonna try that again. You see, Brawl Ral. That's a that's a dumb deck. I'll try that at some point. Maybe, probably. All right. Yeah. So we're both on repeats. It seems. Okay. We will keep. Hmm. Blue. No. Ah! Alright. So what color... This makes white on its own, and I don't have red otherwise. So we'll do red. There we go. Easy enough. I mean, I do, but it's Gateway Plaza. Plus red is part of Joda's casting cost. So it works out. Boop. Bubbity boop bop. Oh boy. If not Arcane Signet, <laughs> it still has to be something. <laughs> yeah. So that she doesn't think I'm mad at her or anything. I, I was going to make a bad dad joke there. I'm, I'm going to refrain. Okay, so this is red, white, blue, and I can play the forest for Choda this turn. That's what we'll do. Next turn, we'll just start puking out Ugans and whatnot. Actually, I think we'll do Garuk for... Well... Yeah, Ugin. Ugin blows stuff up. Yeah. And then this gets to be silly. Sorry. Uh. And then Jody gets to do gets to do his thing. I imagine that these like spirit bombs <laughs> he's holding. Oh no. Oh no. There we go. Oh no. Oh knuckles. Alright. There we go. And then, ta-da. Right. Okay, master. <laughs> it's cute, that move. Alright, now what? Um, yeah, might as well make one while we're here. I can kill her... Let's see. Yeah, let's kill her first. I, th I think is correct. We get to draw a card off of this. After all. All right. Ruinous ultimate. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this is terrible. Uh, <laughs> Point. All right. Why did I do that? Now I have to tap the paradise druid. Oh well. I think we're okay. I have a sneaking suspicion we're alright. Uh, okay, Ugin, Ugin 3 Strong. Ugin 3 Strong. I would have played the ultimatum sooner, but that was my draw off of Garuk. 
So this is this is not how it went yesterday. She was <laughs> she was destroying me. Especially I think I know for a fact she won the first three. Then I won one, then she won one, and even if I won all the others past that. And yeah, the record got better, but she still had a better record on me, so uh, uh, which I think this is kind of her format too, so you sort of expect that. Uh, standard now? Maybe? Alright. Alright. Now let's go back. Hey, there we go. Alright. Oh crap, I did it again. I forgot I did it again. I have to remember to change this every time. There we go. Okay. So, I'll go for the one that she hasn't seen yet. This is Luris, and it works exactly the way you think it works. Oh. Uh, well, actually, no. I'm, a. Uh, mine is a, an Aura's version of, of Luris. Like the Enchantress, Enchantress, the Aura decks that you see in Standard and Historic. Yeah, I mean, it's a nice little curve. We'll take it. Good Dogo. Play our good Dogo first. Silly good Dogo. Alright, Commander. Right away. As you do. Let's do Meyer Triton first. This thing doesn't have flying. I don't know what it looks like it has. Island walk, except that's not a thing anymore. We have to see Heliod gone. <laughs> yes! Uh oh. Inches of Alpha, look at the top five cards you already. Okay, that's fine. Yes. Coral Helm Chronicler. Ooh. Ooh. Other than Luris right now, I don't have any way to gain three life, though. Not yet. We'll get there, but not yet. Uh, so what do I do first? Hmm. In these colors, how much removal could there be? Hmm, I don't know. I feel as if that's a good question. Let's let's play Luris out. We have Selfless Savior, after all. That's that's white. So we can even attack with Luris and use Selfless Savior and get it back. I'm thinking. I'm itching. There we go. Good stretch. Good stretch. Alright. I think we're okay now. So let's see. We can attack with Luris. Actually, we'll attack with both of you. Off to damage. Ooh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't play Knight's Pledge. It's okay. I messed up a little bit. I don't want to play it right now, though. It would be an efficient usage of my mana. You know what? We have... it's... it's okay. That's okay. Oops. In turn, make a griffin. Make a Peter Griffin. <clears throat> I swear, if you bounce that, though. Create a 2-2. Two, two. Okay. Kick shenanigans. Yay. Alright. Whenever you cast a kick spell, create a 2-2. Two, two. Alright. With flying. 
So we both have our two twos with flying engines going on now. Draw a card, discard a card. And the way that this is worded is it's for each mana spent to cast it. So that'll be a 4-4 next time, at least. <sighs> Already. Yeesh. Yeesh. All right, and the way that this is worded, beginning of your end step. All right, so we'll fire off the dead white at the Chronicler. Boop. Kill it. Um, we can attack with Luris first, or we can use the dead white here. I don't think that you have any instants. Well, I know you don't have any instants, actually. Boop. There we go. That's the sound it makes. Boop. Everything except for you. I'd like to save the Dreadful Apathy for... Um, there we go. For the Commander. For Verazol. It won't actually prevent it from doing its thing, though. Okay. You know, odd, to me, anyway, it feels as if Brawl is a format where it's very easy for one player to get a compounding advantage, or that's how it feels so often in games. Alright, if I find a land, then I can go Dreadful Apathy and Exile. We did. We totally did. Alright. Yeah. Ooh. Alright, and then we just make another one. Because, of course... Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's just do it quickly. Uh, well, let's see. When we played yesterday, my Vivian deck was fine. Uh, the Vivian deck won, but Croxa actually lost. I would like to give Croxa another shot, though. Hmm. I have some... Once I get some more rare wild cards, I will try to build some more brawl for us. Oh, thank you for being a good sport about this, Rukulin. I might have one more in me. Um, I'm sure I do. I can make it work. <sighs> Ooh, Tazri! Ooh, five colors in standard. Let's go. Uh, okay. Well, I'm playing a discard commander, so maybe I can... Well, then again, look at this hand. I'm going to try to disrupt her, if at all possible. Okay. So let's go... Mountain... Pass. Probably going to end up cycling the Footfall Crater. Yeah, let's, let's go for it. Beep. Okay. Just filling up the yard a little bit, quickly as we can. Uh, becomes untapped, you may pay to if you do draw a card. So I don't need to do that just yet. Cast a spell from anywhere other than their hand, draw a card. Huh. So in other words, we need to kill this before we fire off Croxa. Because that's not my hand, turns out. I don't know that there are any counterspell shenanigans. I doubt it because it's Tazri. Yeah, let's pass. Hmm. Let's let's just fire. That may not have been the proper timing though. I feel as if it isn't. I think that it isn't. It becomes untapped. So I could have waited had I minded uh, taking the two damage. I could have waited a bit, actually. Okay. Um... See, you have Menace, though, don't you? But you're a creature deck. I could play the Bone Crusher Giant out instead. I would like to get a bunch of extra cards, though. 
then go for blood takes a creature. Wait, no, it's fights. Fights. So in that case, I'd want the giant instead of the crusader. Let's go for it. And then, as red as this hand is, which is entirely too red, maybe we do the mountain first? Mountain escape velocity. I can cast it from the graveyard anyway. Alright, can't block. It'll give me an extra card. It'll give her one as well, but, you know, the timing is that I'll get to play the card before she will. And also, I'm hoping that my deck is better suited to take advantage of the extra card than hers is. Then again, she did just cast a Migration Path. So, probably not, actually. Alright, now we need to discard. As We need to make her discard as much as we can. Let's fire this. Alright. What is that? Deadly Alliance. Okay. Uh, decline. One of the joys of t being a touchscreen is I thought I actually hit the wrong button there for a sec. Let's crash through. We're, we're getting there. Hopefully we're almost there. We're almost at it. And then go for blood cycles for one. Alright. It goes. End turn. Alright, so it'll be four. Well, it's... Three in Croxa. We'll need after that we'll need two more. Which can be Agonizing Remorse, something that died. Alright, so two three deals combat damage to a player draw a card. Uh hello. Okay. So I can use Rider to kill that. That's not so bad. Ow. Death Touch... Okay, cool. That's it. Got it. Cycle... Ah, I could use another Black Source. That would be nice. Uh, that's not what I meant. It's not at all what I meant. Alright. Let's take a look at what you have. Let's hit... Look at the top X cards. X is the number. It's 3 plus the number of creatures. Oh, jeez. That's a lot. How many... the party right now consists of... she's a warrior, warrior, all of them. Okay, so two is the current count, because this can only count for one at a time. Hmm... that's a lot of cards, though. And she can definitely cast it. <sighs> but Brazen Barber is going to mess Croxa up. I can beat a Brazen Barber, though. I don't know if I can beat a Plunderer. Hmm. I don't have the black to cast it anyway. Not yet. I need to wait. I need to just block this adversary. It's not ideal. Also, if I lose my creature, thankfully that'll fuel Croxa. But then Barber is still a thing. It's just overall not not looking that great. <laughs> oh, now we're just doing we're doing it now. Okay. All right, that puts us there. But we're at ten. Draw a card. Okay. I'm thinking, folks. I'm. I'm thinking. Okay. Still didn't find that uh, another black source, so I can't go Croxa and Null Priest. If you were in my graveyard, I could cast Ox. No, I couldn't. I wouldn't have enough in the yard. Alright. Sure, let's do it. Oh, but if I do that, I die. No, wait, I don't. Um, there, there, she's two mana shy from being able to do that. Also, I would have to give up my own escape velocity. Alright. 
So this this will work out. Work out. Alternatively, I could have played Bone Crusher Giant and like Null Priest, which is weird, but I guess it's doable. I guess. All right. All right. Here goes. That's what we were afraid of. Oh, no, no, it's not. That's right. It had already been used to bounce. That's right. I is big dumb. Alright. Attack with just the adversary. Nope. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Double strike. Which means first strike. For, for all I care here, it's just first strike. There we go. I'm trying. I'm doing what I can. What is that? If it was kicked, reveal the tops. Jeez. Put a card that shares a creature type with it from among the in your hand. Okay. Also, it's a 2 mana 3 2 with a bunch of types and a kicker ability. Yeah, that's a, that's a problem. I could legitimately, the fact that it's an elf and it can get elves. Seems like it might be okay. Just maybe. Uh, let's see. I don't have anything in the graveyard except you. So I can play Null Priest, Land Ox. Alternatively, I can go Null Priest. Well, I could do Murderous Rider, but that's all of my black mana. But Murderous Rider can... No, it's fine. It doesn't actually make a difference. It does not. At all. Yeah, so we'll go 1, 2, and then have 5 for Ox. Oop. Here we go. Here goes nothing. Fill the yard. Okay. I can't attack, though. We're on... We can't actually block the 3-1 duty. I did just give away my, my uh, way to kill the borrower in Murderous Rider. I did just get rid of it. But it cost me two life. I would be at five, and then I would die on the swing back. Um, are we dead anyway? Let's see. Yeah, we're, we're dead regardless. Just attack with... No, okay. No, we are. That's right. Because of Tazri. That's right. That's right. Archpriest Tazri. That'll do it. <laughs> Croxa, <Croxel>, why? <laughs> hmm. The answer is I need more kill spells. It's a party deck, so if I can keep her off of having a party... Do you have time for one more? That's all right, sure. Okay. I'm... I'm glad. <laughs> I'm getting my butt kicked. <laughs> all right. When I get done with this, I'll end up, uh... I guess grabbing something to eat. That would be nice. Oh, uh... Standard... or... historic... Brawl. Or regular, if you'd prefer. Hello? Ah, okay. Be -doo. There we go. So, there's only one more that I have... Oh, and it's Vivian. Let me, uh... I already fixed it, didn't I? Yeah, I took out the... Uh, Guardian Project. No, I didn't. Didn't I? Yeah, Hydra's Growth is back, so it should be back to normal. Uh, sure. Okay. Hopefully. Hopefully we're good. Oh! This again. This again. Uh-oh. High curve. No ramp. Much wow. Much wow. I could use... I would very much like a Gilded Goose. That would be awesome. Alright. 
Oh, you know what? I do have one. Hey. Well, I, I kind of got my wish. Lotus cover is not bad at all. I like the look of my hair being down, but just gets in the way a little bit. That's all. That's all there is to it. Okay. Would have liked to play the Scoot Swarm first. I can go lead the Stampede, but if I have too many creatures, I'm going to have to discard. Let's see. This is a deck that actually could kill the Scoot Swarm. So I want to be careful about playing it early, he says, as he just plays it early. I think now is a fine time, though. Oh, he's dead. No. Nope. We're, we're good. At least it should be a deck that doesn't have Wraths or anything, because it's a creature deck. It happens, but not too often. Settle the Wreckage, I can see, because it's asymmetrical. Shatter the Sky... Wait, no, this is, this is standard, that's right. So Shatter the Sky wouldn't be in here. Okay. Triggers. Let's go. Let's make a Vigilant Beast. And pass the turn. As you do. Ooh. There, okay, so it is running Shatter. I mean, it happens. Okay. Uh, I can use the minus here for Wildwood anyway, but I'd rather actually get a creature out. Um... Hmm... This only cares about plus one plus one counters, not just counters, which matters for Vivian. Uh, let's get a little extra mana. Oh, yeah, I didn't have that enough for that anyway. Yeah, I remember seeing it, forgetting about it, then seeing the Troll King and remembering why I didn't play it. <laughs> Funny how that works. Alright, let's play off the top. Draw a card. Hit our land. And now we have you again. Not again, you. Let's uh let's make another vigilant one. Alright. Here goes. I just gave you a turn. Uh oh. Are you an anime character? <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> she might be. Rukulin is an anime character confirmed. Alright, so we have enough that we can play either of these. Witchy ringlets, yes. I knew it, I knew it. But look how high our, our curve is in our hand already. We have... Six, seven, seven, six. And there are only five cards in the deck that are CMC six or greater. So, I don't... And one of them is Auspicious. Yeah, that's not worth it. So we can go Kogla, Fight. Yeah, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. Kogla, Fight, get Thrashing Brontodon. Where are you? And then I can blow up the Felidar Retreat. There we go. Boop. Bibbity bop. Bibbity bop. Hi ya. Okay. Vigilance. Yay. Uh. Oh, okay. Protection from dogs. I have so many of those. Oh, but that's indestructible. Just straight up indestructible. No, it, no, it's protection from dogs as well. Indestructible's the icing on the cake, isn't it? Um. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do this song and dance again. Let's see. 
Uh, yeah, that's okay. We'll fire this off so that we can get a lethal swing next turn, hopefully. Yeah, a little too far. Oh, I, I have Warden as well. I don't think there'll be a lot of targeting my stuff, though. So we'll get Gargaroth. And then... Hmm. Yeah? Yeah. About that. About that. Um... You're the only one that can actually attack. And I would... It's okay. That's alright. Alright. There we go. As you do. Totally matters. So it's going to go as an aura onto uh, Philidar Sovereign. Giving it indestructible. Well, with for the low, low cost of two mana. Velicate Explor Exploration. Exile the top card of your library. You may play that card as long as it remains exiled at the beginning of your upkeep. If there are cards exiled with it, put them into your owner's graveyard, then it deals that much damage to each opponent. Okay. Woo! Hmm. Well, first things first, I guess. Let's, uh... I guess I could use Jim Razor first to make one of my creatures better able to survive combat here. Could put it on the carry added. Let's do it. Hmm. All right, and then beep. That's the sound it makes. That's totally the sound it makes. And then let's do this here on the same one, so that we can blow this up too. Uh, under. There we go. Nice. Uh, I think we're okay. I, I think we've got this one. I have a sneaking suspicion that we have this one. Let's draw a card. Because we don't have enough cards yet. Boom. There we go. Uh, this feels unusual. This feels wrong <laughs> the last few times that we've done this. I think this is the first time I've actually won more than Rukulin has. <laughs> okay. Uh, this won't last forever, I'm sure. <laughs> Better not get used to it. But that was fun. Um, when you're watching this back, thank you. I'm having fun. I am tired, I'm hot. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm hungry. I'm gonna get something to eat. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a minute. I heard that in Dio's voice. Oh, then come as close as you like. <laughs> I think that's what he says. Something like that. <laughs> Okay, okay, enough stretching, that's it. Thanks for playing. <laughs> Stuck up Rich Girl's voice, but I guess that also works. Oh, I got you now. Now I'm picturing, you know, what's her name? Uh, Karine? Street Fighter? Yeah, that's uh, especially Street Fighter 3, my least favorite character in the game. I just don't like her personality at all. Uh, being rich and stuck up is her personality. <laughs> Thankfully she got better in 5, at least from what I've seen. Uh, and she had a rival who naturally ended up being one of my favorite. She also had- oh, she does, doesn't she? 